What is up, Yeet Nation? I'm at my next city to take it out. This is White Run. Just gonna have to kill them all, cause that's what I do in these videos. And I recently learned that there's a map section on the YouTube, like, analytics page. And it shows where all your viewers are from, and I had... Well, of course, five hours from, from Texas because that, that's like, that's where most of my people know me and watch my channel. But I also had surprisingly a lot of other results. I had some from Germany. I had some from Italy. I had some from Estonia. I had a lot from the United Kingdom. I had some from Australia, Brazil, and like 14 seconds in, from Turkey. But also, I had a lot from states. I had some from Florida, New York, a couple others I don't remember. And surprisingly, 4 minutes and 40 seconds from Canada. No, no not, not Canada. 4 minutes and 40 seconds from California. The uh, most surprising thing about that is that I don't know anybody from California, so I must have a fan from the other uh, and then when you click on the region you can actually see what videos they watched and if they're subscribed or not I didn't check for that but uh, if you're watching this from a California person thank you for those uh, views I need to get uh, at least a thousand that'll be a pretty good landmark land milestone ma milestone that's the first major milestone I would like to reach. So, thank you guys from Australia, Brazil, and people that watch to get me up to that goal. I'm pretty sure they don't even speak English in Germany and Italy. I mean, some of them know English, but most of them probably don't speak English. So, the only one I can confirm is the one from California. You don't just, like watch a video for four minutes and not actually like like it's hard to explain but if someone watched four minutes of video from california they're probably gonna watch other videos so yeah again thank you to the person from california for watching my videos that's pretty uh good and that's about it that's all i have right now um my views have gone up a little bit. I have, I have up to 540 views now. No, 538. It's along those lines, but almost at 600. I have like 43 videos. I currently have a couple of videos in my game DVR that uh, I kind of like mass produce the videos and then I upload them as I can. So, I have like four videos in there right now. There's gonna be this one and another really short one. And then tomorrow I upload the other two. And so, more stuff. I'm gonna be getting a laptop for Christmas, which means I can do a whole lot more with my channel. I could eventually get a recording program and do all that kind of crazy stuff, but the main thing, I could Remove the copyright claims from my 200 dabs video. Oh yeah, and quick demonstration of my mod here. NPC ejector force. Creates the best physics ever. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye, dude. Yarl, it would have been more interesting if this, the, uh, it was actually daytime. It was nighttime in this video. So, everyone was asleep. And the best thing about this mod, you could use it on children. So all those annoying children that always yell at you and complain at you. <laughs> you finally do something about it. You can't kill them still, but you could do something about it. Yeah. <laughs> it's, the, it's the greatest thing ever.
So again with the whole laptop thing. I know I'm gonna get it sometime this year. And I'll be able to remove the copyright claims from my 200 dabs video. I have two copyright claims on that video because I played All Star in the video. And now that I think about it, it probably wasn't the greatest idea, but that's like one of my most viewed videos. I'm not gonna say no to views. And I can't remove those copyright claims unless I have a laptop. My phone, it doesn't support the browser. Which is a pretty annoying thing. But it's just gonna have to deal with it. Aw, oh, yeah, you're left. Hate you. Goodbye. Other than that, no major updates for my channel. Again, props to the person from California if you're actually a good fan. Like four minutes compared to a minute for everything everywhere else. Like I have five hours from Texas. And uh, that's to be expected because I'm from Texas. But I don't know anybody anywhere else. I've never even been to any other state. So, having a big fan base around the world is like, kind of a cool thing. I want to have at least one view from every country. That's another one of my goals. Okay, so. I don't demonstrate it yet, but you, you can do this on kids. This video is almost over, and I I killed almost everyone in White Run, so it's not going to be a two-parter. I'm just going to head this straight to five, send it straight to YouTube. Now here is the <laughs> best physics. If you're on uh, Skyrim and you play, if you're on Xbox, if you're, if you play Skyrim and you're on Xbox, Try this mod out, it's called NPC Ejector Force. It's the best mod ever. And now uh, here's a very triggering thing. Even with my cheat brewing mod, that makes me kill almost every NPC. And I killed the other Jarls so far in this series. But it won't let me kill this guy. Why? I know he's kind of important to story, but it lets me kill other story figures, so why not that guy? I just don't get it. And, uh, this video is about almost over. Uh, it's basically all of my channel updates I want to talk about right now, and stuff like that. Again, thank you to all who watched, and goodbye, Yee Nation.